Welcome back, guys, to our playthrough of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Okay, so we are in the end game now. Um, let's talk to Professor real quick here. While trying to complete the Pokedex, we were doing a mission for May, my whatever, and her Munchlax. Her Munchlax was acting up and pointed us to a what looked like a mass outbreak of Zorua. Zoru, I never can say that one right. Anyway, we caught a whole bunch of them, and now we're going to go talk to uh, what's her face, Silene, over in the village. So let's go ahead and do that. We also need to check in so we can get a rank up too. Okay, heading back. We'll complete the mission. We'll check in, see what's up. Etc. 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 Also, uh, let me look at fourteen hundred. Sweet. Get a Reaper cloth for Dusk Noir. Actually, we need to do it for a Scizor. I'm kind of. We haven't seen one of those yet in Dust Noir. I think we saw in the wild, did we not? We haven't spent a lot of time over by that uh, creepy spot. I want to get items. Um, that boat or whatever. Let's see, what is it? A metal coat. Yes. Okay, I'll take that. Swap out Pokemon later. Decided I want to do Scizor, get an alpha one of those before we do Dusk Noir, because I'm not going to have it in my party for a while anyway. A gathering of Zorua in a place other than their natural habitat? Could this also have been caused by the space-time rift? I suppose we don't know enough yet to say for certain. At any rate, thank you for the report. Okay, nice. Oh, we got a bunch of stuff. Bunch likes in May. Bye. Mark, things are growing worse. After we parted, Munchlax reacted to several different locations and there was a mass outbreak at each of them. Simultaneously, in multiple locations. These must be somehow different from the mass outbreaks we know. Why don't we call this new phenomenon a massive mass outbreak? Your new orders are to investigate this massive mass outbreak. Oh, good. That means we might have more chances at Shinies. Sounds like I can count on you to keep investigating. Well then, I'll be waiting for you by the front gate. Cool. Also talk to her. Uh, do some progress. Okay, whatever. Hmm, you have made progress. Seems you've earned yourself a star. <laughs> Nine star man. Oh no, it's eight. Sorry, there's ten total. My bad. I thought there was eleven, but had to recount real quick. With this, you officially attained the rank of 8-star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. You can now use Jet Balls. The rewards you earn for your survey reports will be more generous now. Have these as well. They are for the recipes you'll need for crafting. Okay. Full restores as well. Okay. Let us get to going. It says over here in a second as well. Great, what does this guy get? Oh, it's me. Hi, whatever. I suppose I should tell you exactly what I witnessed first. Munchlax suddenly took off running into a rainstorm. I tried to stop him, let him get wet, lest he get wet, but then I saw those mass outbreaks appearing all over. Perhaps it was a massive mass outbreak that Munchlax was so curious about. If that's the case, Munchlax might be able to help us investigate the phenomenon. I'll also work with you, as I'm concerned about Munchlax. Okay, good to know. We can begin our investigation as soon as you're prepared. Are you ready to go now? Yes. Okay, excellent. Off to Heights Camp with us. We haven't seen anything out of the ordinary yet, nor has Munchlax reacted to anything. Shall we just wait for a while to see whether something happens? The rain. It's raining, and it looks like it's going to get worse. 
Are you worried about the rainstorm, Munchlax? We still don't know what's causing these mysterious mass outbreaks. Where should we look? Perhaps that fancy map of yours can show us something. Pull out your arc phone, bro. There it is. I like the shocked face they always have. What do we got? Oh. Sweet. Can we do them all? I would love to do this. Um, we also need to... Grab these as well. Bunch of packs. We're going to do this one first. Sweet. We're going to go take a look at these massive mass outbreaks now. Massive mass outbreak is a phenomenon in which many mass outbreaks occur at once. Mass outbreaks locations are marked by question marks on the map. You won't know what Pokemon can be found until you go see. There are rare outbreaks with spade in time, so you need to hurry to investigate them. Seems you have some idea where to look for these outbreaks now. Why not check out a few? Yes, let's do that right away. I'll worry about the other stuff uh, after the fact. But before we do that, um, let's go ahead and take a look. I want to see my Pokemon. Okay, move you out. Move you in. Take a look. And evolve. Get a scissor out of it, shall we? First one we've ever seen. Pretty cool. That counts as a catch. Okay, you know what? We'll keep Scizor around for a while. We don't really need that. Uh, let me... What is marked first? The research of myths. The first thing I want to do is have these mass outbreaks. Let's go do that. That is number one focus for me first. Okay, we're real close. like a shinx. So Scizor out there is an alpha. Just knock these guys back a little bit, I think. I wish we could hit more than one Pokemon at a time. It's kind of frustrating that we can't. Cleaver is dope and all, but I might actually switch over to Scizor after all this. Man, if we could find a Shiny Shinx, that'd be cool. I really like the Shiny look of that. Like a macaroni and cheese color. Alright. Is it three more or two more? Did it three more? Okay. That's a crazy attack. I'm only using this just to complete the Pokedex. Just get rid of it later. Oh my gosh, come on with this nonsense. I should probably take a look at the Pokedex entry for this thing and see what sort of challenges I should be doing, other than fighting. Taking so much damage. God. Ultra attack to the maximum, huh? Up oh, a whole new line of... Okay, let's take a look first. What do we have? Best Queen. Okay, let's see. Number caught. Heavy specimens, number defeated, number you defeated the fire type, times you use it, seen it use air slash. Agile and air slash. Okay. So Should be easy enough. Perfect. I do love that. All right, we'll do Agile, Air Slash, these guys, and that should be enough to, I think, do what we want to do here. Let's see. There we go. 
There's one. Well, let me go again. Nope. I don't know who the voice actor was they hired to make that noise in the background. Hey -ya! Yeah. Look at that. That's so dumb. Ah, oh, we gotta use Agile more. Okay, so it looks like. Just the one. Okay, so it looks like the massive mass outbreaks are the same numbers of Pokemon. Between like 12 and 15 or so. But now we've knocked this thing out. A new horde seems to have formed. Oh, oh. oh man. Whoa, dude. That's not what I expected at all. Alphas freaking show up? Damn. Did not see that coming. At all. That's nice. Now we can have like an entire alpha Pokedex if we wanted. I'm going to have to knock these guys out though. If we're going to beat them. Hey, quick. Man, if I can get an entire alpha line of Eevees... Heck yeah, yeah. Double Alpha Shanks. Oh, no, don't let me fight one at a time. I wonder if that's the rules of Alpha Battles, is we only get one at a time. Actually, you know, well, because I, yeah, I fought an Alpha, I think, before, and maybe another non-Alpha, but I don't think two Alphas at once. Hmm, maybe Alpha Shinies isn't so rare after all. things form. Nice, though. At least we got uh, a bunch of items out of it. It looks like... Oh, there's more. What the heck? Oh, I thought that was a whole other... Okay, whatever. There was a Alpha Starly over there. Is that another, like, horde? Let's get out of here hit by that thing. How did he hit me with his energy from back there? Also, since the time rift thing has been closed, why are there still alphas running around? Don't get me wrong, I'm glad there are because I want to catch them, but it doesn't really make a lot of sense. Because these are like new ones forming, you know? Okay, so there's that one done. All right, and I think now, actually, if I face this direction, yeah, right behind me should be another. Oh, I missed it, it's this way. If 
I get farther enough away, is he gonna block it? This guy. That is ridiculous. Oh, fight him. Godline creeps me out so much. Oh, he's a really strong one, too, at level 62. Aw. Scum. At least we got a Mr. Mime, that's something. Okay, now what? Where are we? Just the other way? Nope, there's one right down here. This might be the Scyther one. Oh no, they're different Pokemon, that's right. They're not native to their location. That makes sense. I don't care about more Shinx. Although, that's not a bad idea. I could basically just swing around and like scope out ones I've never seen before. So, like, since we just saw that was a Shinx one, we can just move on. How far away from we the satchels? Looks like they're over here. Okay, we're coming up on a satchel. Is that a Floatzel or a Weasel? Ah, uh, Weasel's lame. Okay, should be right about over here. There it is. No, it's wood. Where is it? I'm like right on it. Oh, maybe not right on it. that. Now we need to get to the island, which is this way. Two satchels over here. Right? Yeah. The bigger island of the two. Okay, it looks like the center of the island has one by the Infernape. Unless that's it. Yeah, that's one. Looks like we have another outbreak over here. Kadabra should be right in front of me. Right over here. What are you? Uh, actually, on Furnos, I do need those. Huh? 
Infernape Alpha, Infernape Non, and then a Monferno. Nice. These would be useful for the Pokedex. But see, I can just capture these, and then we can move on to the next area. Because we need to do three of them. Uh-oh. An unusual move. See if any more pop up over here. Yes, we did. Actually, that means that we have to get Chimchar as well, and we've not seen any of those in the wild yet. Right? Yeah. Hmm. That's curious. I wonder why they're not popping up here. I would think they would be. We got this one. Nice. Nice. Okay, how many is that? Five of five. Capture this one as well, why not? And then I'm gonna dip, I think. If there's not gonna be any Chimchar here, then I'm not gonna try and go after him. God, these things just keep on coming. I'm gonna catch this one too. Just because I don't know how many I need to complete the Pokedex entry for this thing. But we'll be close. And as long as I don't finish off the Infernapes, then I think this Mass Mass Outbreak thing will stay around so I can move on to another one without this one counting against me. I was just thinking, as we continue to do stuff with the Pokedex, it's so crazy to me that Charizard, I'm sorry, Charmander and his line, Bulbasaur and Squirtle are not in this game. I get why, because there's so many other starters that need some attention, but like, there's never been a game that didn't have a Pikachu in it, right? But this is the first time the Charmander line hasn't been in a game. There we go. Right? that thing is menacing. Okay, should be another one right straight ahead of me. What is it? Anything interesting? Zubats. Eh, shiny Zubat would be cool because that'll evolve into a really cool gold, uh, Crobat, but not that interested. close to being over now. Sveal. Wow, it just rolled away? That's kind of cool. So we got enough of those. Oh, another one rolled over there. 
another toga tick. Actually, we need to grab that one real quickly. up here Let's see what this one's all about ah crap get to the next one we'll have to do this one really quickly okay right on top of it what are you ah uh, This one might be a little more interesting. I was wrong. Dang it. My team sucks right now. Not really interested in fighting with these guys. Um, okay, there we go. damage level 32 can do. Stupid. Is it all three or is it just two? Three. a little bit. Like they don't spawn in the exact same spot each time. Or Star Raptor. What the hell? What are these doing here? Oh, fun. I can actually put the Pokedex entry for these guys then, if that's the case. Uh, let's go ahead and get this taken care of right away. I thought the rain was over and then it looks like it's drizzling a little bit. And these guys showed up. That's so great. We, gotta, we have a lot to learn about these massive mass outbreaks. That might hurt. Oh boy. That's cool how the animation shows it flying up so high and coming back down. That's pretty dope. Let's see. Oh, Brown, I'm going to throw you out there. My team's kind of garbage right now.
Oh boy. Is it just you two, though? Looks like it. Oh, there's a third. Come on. Man, they are aggressive as hell. So Raptor's line of attacks are really animated and really freaking cool. I'm around you to stand there and take the damage, okay? Ah. I want to see it do it again from far away to see how high it goes up. Something's still here. It's down there. I think that's the last one. Are there more massive mass outbreaks, though? If they pop up on the map like this, then I can just do them all the time. up its defense and offense and then uses Roost when it's got full health. Hang in there, Embryon. Okay, we actually have to fight this stupid thing. getting spanked so hard. I know, bug Pokemon. Stupid. Actually, screw this. Let's heal the team a little bit real quickly. Yeah, I need to reevaluate my team. My team is trash right now. thing. I needed to have an electric. I gotta have the basic types on here. Okay, there. Now we should catch this thing. You know how a lot of the healing items ugh, look like sprays or lotions or something to heal the damage? I look at a lot of the items and I wonder, like, what exactly are they? Like, you look at the revive, what is that little diamond? What is that supposed to do? That's one hell of a suppository, if that's what you're gonna use to wake somebody up from being unconscious. Oh my god! I'm just gonna knock this thing out. I'm so tired of it. If he doesn't knock this guy out first. Just get out of here. I'm so sick of it. I've already caught all of your friends. Ugh! Dang, he went up really high. I'll be able to catch now anyway. Yeah, if he doesn't do that again. No more recoil attacks. This, there's no way with your one HP left. There's no way you don't get caught here. Thank you. Okay, so what happens now? Well, yeah, it looks like the outbreak is no longer present. Let's go heal up. Okay, now we got 
that. We're going to swap the Pokemon around in a second, but... Okay. Okay. Now let's take a look at the Pokedex and see... Best Queen is finally complete. Thank goodness, that wasn't so bad. Nope. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead. I'm gonna get you out, because you're an alpha. Actually, no, we won't release you. I'm gonna move you, and we're gonna keep you around for some Pokedex stuff. Also, we're going to move you there. Scissor. We have to do two, two little bits of data for that. I have to focus on each one and what their challenges are. Okay. Um. First things first. Let's do this. Um. I'm Junior can evolve. Don't want to do that quite yet, do I? Let's take a look and see what the Pokedex says about our lineup of Pokemon first. Mime Jr. is done. Mr. Mime is not. Okay, so we can't evolve it. Had I known that was the case, I didn't even think about it. Just get a whole bunch of Mime Jr. at high level and just evolve them all. Such a creepy freak. Nasty. Okay, so that counts as a four capture. But now, though, if I look at Mr. Mime, so what do we have to do? We need to cap level seven times you're giving it food. Scared it off with a scatterbang. Times you're going to use an agile move. Okay. So that's what we'll do, is we're going to go ahead and get into a whole bunch of fights and just use agile moves. Um, let's see. Got some birds here. Wild Munchlax. Gotcha. What are you doing over here? Cool. Some Geo dude down here in this little crevasse, but huh? Munchlax be chilling. Get that for me, slave. Fight, Psychic, Agile. Okay. 
Knock you out. Knock you out. What next? Huh. Surprised we found Munchlax so close to where I is at. I feel bad that it's like this tiny little bird that just wants to run away and I'm walking into a fight with a freaking mime Pokemon. Like a mime elf monster thing. Ugh. That could have been bad if I would have fallen. Okay. Again. Fight. Agile style. Get it gone. That's fine. Does that count as actually using one, though? Probably not, huh? Damn it. Gotcha. Send headbutt agile. Ugh. Okay, I'm glad he actually avoided that. I want didn't hit the agile style thing that time. Oh my god, I don't even care anymore. I'm gonna go to another Pokemon that's easier to fight. Stupid. Sorry, Sarley. You're just very easy to take on. <sighs> Annoying. Break it out, please. Dude, are you kidding me? What is the deal? Why is not he not hitting anything? What is his problem? Just use this, I guess. That should be enough, right? Okay, good. Get out of here. Okay, fantastic. Now, if I take a look at the Pokedex for Mr. Mime, still at level 7. Time to see it use an agile style move. Damn, not enough. This is the most annoying aspect of this. Whatever, I'm just gonna do combine a whole bunch. Ugh. Should have expected that. I need something that's not gonna run away.
Just running. Okay, I need to do it three more times. You. Of course, I can only have two. I hopefully have a PowerPoint boosting item that can bring his attacks back up. Wait, why did it only do it once? I thought those went down a little too fast. I know I didn't do that many. Anyway. Okay, trying again. <laughs> I'm just running around knocking out these animals, like, so willy-like. I kind of feel bad for it. Oh, because Agile Style uses more than one, of course. I didn't realize that it... I guess it didn't register in my mind that it takes up more power points. That makes sense now. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, so now, if that's the case, go back, level 7, 12, member comp 4, no, maybe we caught that. Okay. Oh, that's fine, I guess. Alpha Heracross isn't present. <laughs> now, Mark, according to my own investigations... Oh! Alpha Vespa Queen. Terribly sorry, Mark, but... Do you think you can handle it? Yeah. What level is it at? Mr. Mime. Ugh, I'm so embarrassed using this thing. Level 60. Look at this size differential. Oh boy. That's right, Infernia will finish this off. Mr. Mind's a pet project. Eh, not doing too well. Stone plate. Oh, okay. So we have to go and we attract all these down that way. That's what he wants. Okay, okay. Why did that Alpha Pokemon have the plate we were looking for? Maybe it just happened to find the plate lying around. In any case, that's the only other plate that I had any information about, so that's that. And yet nothing seems to be happening, which makes me suspect there must still be more plates left out for us to find. Not to worry, I know the perfect person to ask. She's bound to know all about the plates. The only, the one and only Mistress Kogita. Yes, you haven't had the chance to properly thank her for her help in obtaining the red chain. Am I right? All the more reason to pay her a visit. So onward to the ancient retreat. Oh, we'll uh, leave you to your thoughts. I think we're I think we're good. I'm not seeing any Pokemon that are even worth it. This whole thing for 
Waiting was a waste of time. All right. I think that's a good point for us to stop. We'll go ahead and wrap things up here. Anything interesting there? No. Okay. We'll wrap things up and we'll continue with a brand new episode of the playthrough tomorrow where we'll continue on to things, trying to find the plates, trying to complete the Pokedex, catching legendaries and all that stuff, which will uh, come later once we figure out how to do them. Anyway, that's it for me, guys. Take care of yourselves. Be well. I hope to see you when we continue on with our playthrough of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Before you go, though, if you want to show some love by hitting the like button, do not forget to subscribe. If you have any feedback for me, leave it in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Otherwise, uh, I'll see you when I see you. All right, guys. Take care of yourselves. See you next time. Later.